Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. Our process is staff attendance management system. Let's say start with Upstart. Uh, the staff and payroll system objective is to provide a system which manages the employee details, the payroll activity done in a college depending upon the staff attendance and its calculation which is a very huge. The users will consume less amount of time through computerized system rather than working manually. The system will take care of all the payroll activities like managing each employee's attendance, the number of leaves taken by that particular staff and calculation in a very quick manner. Data storing is easier, paperwork will be reduced and the company staffs spend more time on monitoring the progress. The system is user friendly and easy to use and all the important data will be stored in the database and it avoids any miscalculation. Let's we see the flow diagram of our process. Initially, the uh, new, new staff will register their details with the database system and the uh, user ID and password will be generated during the registration process. By using the uh, user ID, they can uh, provide their uh, attendance uh, uh, each day. These the attendance details will be inserted into the database separately. And uh, the, uh, the new staff can uh, not only provide attendance, they can also uh, taking uh, leave and uh, provide getting the uh, requesting uh, form to get the leave, leave details uh, like uh, OD, OT, etc. And the administrator at the other end will uh, see the whole staff uh, information, uh, attendance information, and will pr prepare the uh, leave, de leave, leave count and the salary information. And by, uh, based on the number of uh, days uh, the staff uh, pro get attendance, the salary will be calculated. Let us see the demo of our process. Initially, we have to run the staff running system. This, uh, this process is for registering a new staff information with the database. So, run this process. Here we have to provide the name value, gender value, department value, designation value, age value, mail id, phone number and main subject and staff id and mutual section password and uh, we have to choose the profile picture for the for our uh, new registration information. Uh, by clicking on register button it will be registered with the database system. We have to use this uh, value, we have to use this uh, staff id and the password to log in for further further information click on ok here provide staff id and password value click on login button to continue the login uh, login is successful then provide by providing a login ID, staff id value and click on check button it will be it will show the um, number of uh, attendance details here this is a new registration staff detail so it, uh, initially it will be empty here provide staff id and password value click on login button here by providing a staff id value we can check the number of days uh, leave taken and the in time and out time click on next by choosing the particular month value we can see the number of uh, attendance details for a particular month so click on apply for CL here we can uh, take a uh, uh, we can provide the staff ID value and it will fetch the uh, name and department designation value you have to provide the reason for taking CL click on submit button to submit the details uh, to the administrator so the CL permission is applied successfully click, click back button and uh, here we can apply for OD also click on apply for OD detail and provide the staff ID information and the corresponding name department designation will be fixed then provide the reason for taking OD click on submit button the OD permission is uh, successfully applied click on OK button click back like this we can also uh, taking here uh, Applying for OT here provide staff ID data then provide the reason click on OT button the click on submit button the OT permission also applied successfully then click back button click on next button here 
we can uh, check for the number of what is taken what is taken in the cl taken and the remaining cl uh, available so here provide staff id information choose the particular month click on click button it it shows how uh, number of uh, what is taken for this particular month and what is taken cl taken and the remaining uh, cl available for this month then click on next button it will show the uh, staff attendance uh, salary bill detail by providing the staff id the salary bill detail for this particular staff id will be uh, shown here so click on check button this is the uh, staff uh, this uh, this is the salary information for this corresponding staff id then click on exit button with this the staff attendance system is uh, system process is completed around the attendance process here provide the staff id to provide attendance click on this button give attendance here the correspond the particular date and time value will be inserted as a in time click ok then click finish to provide out time we have to again log in and uh, provide the attendance so this these data will be inserted into the database for future as uh, a calculation now run the admin process provide the admin data click on ok button uh, this will be uh, this process is for viewing the number of percent uh, and the number of days leave taken of the particular uh, staff data then uh, click on next button here provide uh, this this form is used to view the uh, particular staff id attendance data here i am giving this id value and click on search button so this is the particular uh, staff id's uh, attendance detail then uh, click on a month day month it will show the uh, attendance detail for this particular month so click on search detail it will show the number of days leave taken and the number of days present number of days uh, od taken if we, if we choose a different month detail it will show the corresponding uh, attendance detail then click on store information the information is stored into the database successfully for uh, preparing the bill detail now, now click on next button here provide the staff id and uh, choose month click on search button it will show the staff details like a uh, department designation in the bill number and the number of days present by clicking on get basic pay the corresponding basic pay will be fetched and uh, this generate bill number will be for a uh, new registered uh, staff to get uh, to generate a bill number then by clicking on calculate salary the salary will be calculated based on the a number of days present now the salary information is prepared by clicking on save data this will be this detail will be saved into the database and uh, this will be uh, viewed by the particular staff in future the salary bill is calculated successfully by this the procedure is uh, completed thanks for listening